Are you able okay. to still see my screen? <laughs> I can see your screen to the point that I can see one of your um, tabs. <laughs> what? Chickpeat, boy. Love you, guys. पॉडकास्ट <laughs> like if you if you know me by now you probably know that i make fun of stuff but one if you get to know me at at a certain point of time you know how i react to stuff so yeah. it's like uh, the other day when uh, i i referred to you as uh, what was that i i know what you're talking about i just can't think of what you referred to me as and i read it and then i saw everyone going she might not have preferred to be called that and i was like he <laughs> Mike Jake want to please, please this is not a podcast I want to cut train from Moscow to Nobody Vladivostok please, this is it not a podcast wait it's not what it's 11 pm right but it's a sunday for you saturday at the moment um but there's also a public holiday on monday because today was anzac day today's what anzac day um australian and new zealand army corps um it's remembering soldiers that went to war oh so, Obviously today was a little bit different than how it is normally celebrated because normally we go to a war um memorial memorial yeah um but obviously we can't do that at the moment so we had this thing called driveway at dawn so people would go out to the driveway at 6 a.m. and do it I had my alarm set for 5:40 and I turned it off and I went back to sleep and then at 6:10 it started bucketing down with rain and I woke up and then I looked at the time and I went oh I forgot it mm-hmm. um so I felt really bad but my dad went out to the driveway and he said that there was about 10 other people that were out there which was nice so. What what do you do after going out in the driveway Um so you listen to the last post which um oh I want to see if I can say it off by heart um they will not grow old as we grow old um and age should not worry them as the years condemn we remember them less we forget oh i definitely don't okay, have that okay i've um, heard this yeah i've heard this say, normally on anzac day there would be a cricket match and then you also play this game called two up which is something about it was derived from cricket so okay. um cricket cricket's quite quite a big thing on Anzac Day but obviously not today <laughs> they shall grow not old as we are left to grow old age should not worry them nor the years condemn at the going down of the sun and in the morning we will remember them lest we forget Anzac Day i think outside of India if at all I know the most about any country it's Australia because I've grown up we from through cricket and the project that I did and of course begin like we have hollywood like american tv shows and uh, movies you you just know american culture through them mm, but definitely th- yeah there are no aussie movies or tv shows that I've watched so even though I have I know about australia and I've, I've read up a lot and I'm act- I can only know about aussie culture when I speak with actual australians you can't just attach a personality to an entire country but yeah, <laughs> yeah. but uh, i think aussies are famous in india at least the uh, impression is aussies are someone who fight very hard and they just like they never back down and they are very aggressive and stuff yeah and you see videos like we you see videos of australia playing uh, aussie rules football you kind of have to agree yeah. <laughs> I've never been a fan of contact sport. Uh <laughs> but I think Australia would do really well if they had a Quidditch team. Um, <laughs> yeah. We do have a lot of Indians um that live in Australia because I think I I remember telling you um all the names and there's like Raman Pree and Man Pree and then at the moment we've oh, got Renu. Six. We've They're got all six. Renu. What does six mean? Six. Okay, six is like a religion. It's a religion basically. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant six like S I X and I'm like Does that mean like there's six 
No, no, no. Person. No. Um, uh, I, sorry, I know what sick is. Yeah. So <laughs> um, any sorry. name, if it if it ends with Preet, it's they are sick. You just know. Ah, um, okay. It must be really confusing because you've got your local language, then you've got Hindi, and then you've got English as well. Hindi, I didn't start learning until I moved to Delhi. Actually, that's another misconception that I, all Indians know Hindi. We don't. It's like uh, only forty-four percent of India, especially the north. The north, uh, yeah, they they speak Hindi. Other than that, our states are divided on linguistic basis. So every state has its own state language. So I am from one of the south southern states. So I am from Karnataka. So we learn English, we learn Kannada, and then there's another language that we speak at home, at least with me. So yeah, what's that, that one? I speak Konkani. Okay, this is something that we haven't never talked. So I might put this on. Add this in the podcast. I think a few of them you could probably put it through. I just don't look great, but yeah, I think some of the conversations that we've been bringing up now. Yeah, um, it's been good, yeah. right? Uh, this is something <laughs> I that I did last year. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It's like like Mari said. Mo- mo- most people just listen to it. Don't people don't even watch? Like, I'm not saying people shouldn't. We interrupt this program to bring you a special report. Are you able okay. to still see my screen? Yeah, it's a bit blurry. Um, <laughs> I can see your screen to the point that I can see one of your um tabs. <laughs> what? One of the tabs is making me laugh up the top. <laughs> oh, okay. I I logged in. No, you should not have seen it. I'm going to close it. <laughs> so that is why you were smiling. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. <laughs> And you're probably like, why is she smiling? This is weird. <laughs> I'm just sitting there going, hee. <laughs> no. <laughs> But I want to do a, a video where it says I I swiped on every profile on Tinder for 30 days. Oh, yeah. Yeah, do that. Yeah. <laughs> That would be fun. <laughs> But I also found out later on that Tinder has a ranking system. It's based on the ratio of the number of people you swipe right and the number of people that swipe right on you if more people swipe right on you than the people then you swipe right on people your ranking goes up and okay. uh, when people random people open tinder on in your area the likelihood of your profile coming up is higher so when you do stunts like this where you swipe right on every profile and not enough people are swiping right on you your ranking goes down and oh, no. eventually so you are not. like when a girl opens like a woman opens tinder in in an area around me <laughs> my profile will never show up because it will be so low that she'll have gotten bored or she'll have even found a match before she sees my profile so yeah that's one of the reasons why maybe i got zero matches but that also could be because i'm ugly and my profile is not interesting enough but i don't want to admit that music <laughs> wow, we've been talking for three hours. <laughs> We have. Thank you for watching the video. Oh, oh fuck! Oh. That is one big pile of shit. Google sing happy birthday to Bebel Happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday dear Bamabo Happy birthday to you Who's Bamabo <laughs>